Hello friends, my name is Scott and this is How to Master SHSAT Math, where we're going to do a new problem every single week on this channel. So let's get started now. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to solve for a variable when all you have are variables. So we need to isolate the variable x in this problem. If you already know how to do that, go ahead and solve the problem now, hit pause, because I'll reveal the answer in 3, 2, 1. Our answer is a times y over b. Let's do it together. What we want to do in this problem is get x all by itself, right? So I don't want x to be part of a fraction. So let's multiply both sides of the equation by x. So we end up with x and x, right? The x's cancel out. So on the left side of the equation, we're left with a. That's going to equal b times x, which we can write as bx over y. I still don't like that there's fractions here, so now let's multiply both sides by y. So we're going to times it by y over here and y over here. The y's again cancel out, and now we have y times a on the left equals bx on the right. So we have to get x by itself, so we're going to divide each side by b to get rid of that b. The b's cancel out. We're left with ya, or ay, doesn't matter what order it is, divided by b. So our answer is either ya, ay, if we put it in alphabetical order, over b. Hey everyone, thanks for checking out our video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. We would greatly appreciate it. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave those below as well. And in the description, there's a link for 50% off my math course, how to Master SHSAT Math. All right, that's it. We'll see you next week. Bye. Emma, say bye. Emma, say bye to the people. Bye, YouTube. Say bye. Yeah, bye.